When you think Netflix, you think streaming on your television, not going to a movie theater. But that's changing. Netflix has a bunch of films that are hitting the big screen before the small screen. Cinema before streaming is on the hot list. Action. <laughs> The first Netflix movie headed to the big screen soon, Dolomite Is My Name. If I get up in that light with my own movie, I could be everywhere all at once. Let's bring Dolomite to the screen. This one's based on a true story with Eddie Murphy starring as filmmaker Rudy Ray Moore, who's best known for portraying the character of Dolomite in stand-up comedy and a series of films starting back in the 1970s. What did you do to your hair? You look like a pimp. It's all pretend. I just created a character. Dolomite. The movie's getting great reviews and also includes Wesley Snipes, Craig Robinson, Keegan-Michael Key, Mike Epps, and Snoop Dogg. It's debuting in theaters this Friday before headed to Netflix October 25th. Cut! Was it good to shave? Then next Friday in theaters, Netflix debuts a much more dramatic film, The King, at number two. A new chapter of my life has begun. Already I can feel the weight of this crown I wear. All hail, King Henry! This one stars Timothy Chalamet as a young king, Joel Edgerton as one of his most loyal of followers, and Robert Pattinson as the foe looking to bring the king down. If you don't want to see it on the big screen, it will premiere on Netflix November 1st. Do you feel a sense of achievement? In what regard? In any regard. <laughs> And the star power continues with the next Netflix title, The Irishman at number three. Do you want to be a part of this fight? Would you like to be a part of this history? Yes, I would. Whatever you need me to do, I'm available. Fans of mobster movies get excited. Robert De Niro, Al Pacino, and Joe Pesci starred in this movie, which is directed by Martin Scorsese. It's based on a true story and is in select theaters November 1st before debuting on Netflix November 27th. It was like the army. You followed orders. You did the right thing. You got rewarded. That movie's gotten a lot of buzz for being one of Scorsese and Netflix's most expensive movies, costing about 159 mil. Compare that to the budget of our final film, about 8 mil, to make Marriage Story at number four. I thought we should talk. Okay. I don't know how to start. Scarlett Johansson and Adam Driver co-star in this movie, which currently has 100% good reviews on Rotten Tomatoes. You can watch this married couple go from happy to not so happy on the big screen November 6th, or wait all the way until December 6th to watch it on Netflix. What? Are you kidding me? Netflix taking over the small and the big screen on the hot list.